this is a great day for South Jersey and for New Jersey's veterans. Uh, we heard all during the last year a lot of conversation about the dysfunction and lack of service that was being provided by the Veterans Administration um, to veterans around this country, and it caused enormous outrage among American citizens who believed the promise that the government had made to the military men and women and their families, which is, if you serve our country admirably and honorably, that we will take care of you for the rest of your life. Um, the good thing about America is that even when we make mistakes, uh, and clearly things that happened at the VA were big mistakes, um, the rest of America steps in to help to fill the void that's created by those mistakes. And what we're seeing here today with Hero Care Connect is a perfect example of that. New Jersey's home to more than 413,000 veterans. More than 176,000 of those veterans live right here in Burlington, Camden, Gloucester, Mercer, Monmouth, and Ocean Counties. And understand that so many of our veterans um, wind up settling here um, after they conclude their military service with their families. And we're proud of that in New Jersey. Add to that the 44,000 airmen and soldiers, sailors, Marines, Coast Guardsmen, and their family who live and work at the Joint Base. And you could see that this is a critical hub for the provision of health care to men and women both who have served in the military and who are currently serving in the military. Um, you heard from um, both Mr. Trebor and Ms. Kirby, about, Dr. Kirby, about the Hero Care Connect program. I'm not going to repeat what they've already said, except to say that it is critical for our veterans to have access to medical care when they need it. Um, also critical to understand that they are active participants in their decisions about their health care. Um, the example of that was the ones that don't want same-day care. Then they're not taking it, whether you offer it or not. We have to create a collaboration with our veterans. We have trusted these men and women to make enormous decisions on behalf of our country. We need them to be permitted to be collaborators in their own health care in making the decisions about what they believe is best for them and for their families, and to get that health care when it's decided upon as quickly as possible so that the healing process can begin. Um, that's what Hero Care Connect um, is going to help to do.